Hey, Neil Williams here. Today, this video, we're gonna have a look at grip pressure and how it controls your club face. So let's get to it. So grip pressure is really important when it comes to this swing. I find if I'm tighter with my left hand, the club face typically will be open and I'll probably hit a cut. Um, if I grip tighter with my right hand, the club face will turn over a little bit. My hand, my right hand will overtake my left hand and it'll shut a little bit. So this is a really good tip. If you want to um, shape the ball or if you're slicing the ball right or left, just check your grip pressure. So if you're going out right, if your ball goes out right, grip tighter with your right hand and looser with your left hand. That'll get your hands overtaking. So tighter with your right hand and the club face will overtake. So causing the club face to close rather than opening up. So let's give it a go. So we're gonna go for the nice draw here. So grip tighter with your right hand a little bit, looser with the left hand and I expect the club face to turn over through the swing. If you're going left, maybe grip tighter with your left hand uh, and looser with your right hand and the club face will be a bit more squared up towards the target. If you hit a hook shot, have the grip pressure slightly stronger, club face will be opened up through the swing or typically could end up going towards the target rather than flipping over. So a nice cut shot now, club face pointing the target, slightly left, aim slightly left of it, grip tighter with our left hand and I'm feeling like I'm almost like holding off a little bit. I wouldn't recommend holding off on the, um, for the, um, uh, a straighter shot but club face is going to be open to the target. So you cut shot. Ideally, we want to get the club face pointed at the target and the grip pressure, we want to be equal portions between two, equal uh, pressure between the two. To hit a straight shot, equal pressure between the two. There you go, enjoy. <laughs> 